Hello guys, this is John AE5X, and um, I've been playing in the AWRL DX contest CW for uh, probably 10 hours or so of, of accumulated time with my brand new IC705, and I wanted to show you uh, the way I've been using the filters because I haven't seen this documented or, or talked about elsewhere. It probably has been, I just haven't come across it. But uh, anyway, in case you haven't either. Um, as you may know, there are three filters selectable for each mode, and you can change the bandwidth of each filter to suit what you want. This is the widest filter, filter 1. Filter 2 is narrower, and filter 3 is narrower yet. And you can put those to whatever bandwidth you want down to 50 hertz but and that's pretty handy you have three steps available to you but what I've been doing in the contest is this if you press on and hold one of the filters you get the filter dialog box up and if you touch the bandwidth option here you can change the filter on the fly you don't have to settle for the three steps whatever you've programmed in you can put them to what you want them to be and we can tune to a signal here. So I'm very wide here, and rather than going rather than going to another stepped size, I can vary it in 50 hertz steps or 100 hertz until I get down to 450, and then it's 50 hertz steps. Touch it again and. And it's back to being a VFO dial here. So it's pretty handy to be able to do that on the fly and not be relegated to whatever three bandwidths you have programmed in uh, already for that particular mode. Okay, that's it. Uh, I'm liking the radio quite a bit. It's a keeper. 73.